Cocaic geckos and some insects, such as this beetle, have microscopic hairs on their feet that provide dry adhesion via molecular forces, enabling them to climb glass walls and walk inverted on ceilings. Inspired by animal attachment mechanisms, a new adhesive made from microstructured polyvinyl siloxane, or PVS, has been developed by the Goatlip Binder Company in collaboration with the Max Planck Institute. We have constructed a small robot to evaluate their adhesive as a foot material. Miniwags are a series of small robots that use a single motor to drive their multi-spoke wheel leg appendages for locomotion. We have developed a radio-controlled 9 centimeter long miniwags that can be used to test new biologically inspired adhesive technologies. It has a total of four wheel legs, each with four spokes. The flexible feet are bonded to contact areas on the ends of the spokes. In preparation for testing the PVS, we first used scotch tape, which is a pressure sensitive adhesive, or PSA, to gauge the climbing performance of miniwags on clean glass surfaces. The robot can make several kinds of transitions, climb up and down vertical glass walls, and walk inverted on ceilings. By steering gradually, the robot can also turn on vertical surfaces. This design allows the robot to make transitions around interior angles. Even if feet are damaged or lost, the robot continues without falling off the surface. Animals make contact with the entire foot pad surface early in stance and then detach their feet by peeling them gradually from the substrate. Similarly, Miniwig's feet contact the substrate, bend as the hub turns, peel off the substrate gradually, and spring back to their initial position for the next contact. The problem with PSA feet is that they become contaminated with dirt so they lose their adhesive properties and must be replaced often. Miniwags was able to climb walls using feet made from PVS. It was able to scale a 60 degree incline reliably with a 7 centimeter tail. The robot made 13 40 centimeter runs without requiring cleaning, lasting almost twice as long as scotch tape. Cleaning the feet with soap and water renewed their attachment properties. Reversing the driving direction caused the robot's feet to become detached. Then as the robot slid down the substrate, the feet would often re-adhere to the glass, catching the robot as it fell. By lengthening the tail to 25 centimeters and widening the back feet, the robot was able to adhere to a vertical glass surface indefinitely and climb. With the current version of the structured PVS material, walking on the vertical surface was less reliable than with the tape. The robot would sometimes slide or lose traction on the substrate. In summary, biologically inspired materials can enable robots to climb on smooth surfaces and perform many valuable missions. Improved versions of the current PVS material are showing even greater promise.